Yep. All right, there you mate. Yep. Bill just got it. One bat should have it. Paul should have it. Uh, one bat's not coming on because he's got something on today. Yep. That's all right. Yep. Yep. There's Paul. Check your emails, buddy. Bill should be able to do his. He should be on there in a second. Yep. Oh. So, have you managed to do any more on your Spitfire, mate? Oh, mate, not this week. Not at all. Jeez. Yeah. <laughs> That's pretty hectic. That's fair enough. And then I've got um, Moss. He's um, asked me to make the – Epix is bringing out a new boat, I believe, this month. Hang on. Here we go. Add to there. Oh, back again. Yeah. It is. It's either the Shannon class lifeboat or the Sp yep. Severin class lifeboat. And he's asked me to create the colours, and I've got a few of them. Oh, hey, Shannon. Um, a few. Out of the six colours, I've got four sorted, so. Oh, nice. And I think he's one of the Ajax as well and whatever, so. Yep. I hope Bill just got his email, but, yeah, so Moss has got those. Um, so I'm not sure if he wants me to make them in brushables or not, but, yeah. Emails there, mate. It's been sent. Yeah. It has been sent. Oh, I got it. Yeah. So we got six. I'm glad people managed to jump on. Sorry for the delay, folks. We've uh <clears throat> Paul James yeah. wasn't given instructions, he just uh he did his best and we're supposed to be on this morning, but uh we didn't get that sorted. There's a few issues. Oh, not issues, but you know, just stuff that comes up in everyday life that you don't plan for. And yeah, that's yeah. it. Uh, my daughter's uh, preparing our dinner tonight, which is good. Not yet twelve, but she's cooking dinner for us. Beautiful. So, you know, got to teach him young, otherwise they won't be able to fend for himself. I wonder if Bill just got his email yet. Haven't heard anything there. So. Oh. Uh, so when you're going to, um, or when are you looking at releasing the brushables in general there, Jason? Mate, that could be a little while down the track as I've got um, to get these colours done. Yep. And then there's the orders to be shipped over there. Good to see your head, Paul. Yeah, as rough as it is. Yeah, we won't get to say anything, mate, but uh, yeah, we love you. I have, a, I have a great head for radio and a great voice for silent movies. Yeah, nah, mate, you're bloody top quality. Um, yeah, so it's getting those there. I'm just going to quickly, quickly, hang on, whereabouts? Um, copy that. Oh, here it is. I don't need to do that. There we go. Boom. Welcome back, buddy. Um, hey, that's good lighting there, Paul, too. Yeah. Hang on, I'll need to get the head powdered. <laughs> um, I'm reckon about six months, mate. Um, I have an idea on how I want to go about it. Yep. 
as I said to the boys in the US, I, I want to have a decent range ready to rock and roll because they'll fly off the shelves and then they'll winch because they can't get them. What's that? Then they'll winch because they, they can't get them. Morning, Sir Richard. Um, oh, that's who I forgot to get hold of. Um, John, what's this? Um, Jim, 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 Jim. Oh, well, I forgot to... Hey, Dave, how are you, mate? Hopefully Jim's awake there and he... Oh, no. Welcome, Dave. Um, yeah, so I've just sent that to Jim, so hopefully he gets that and he's awake, even though it's usually, what, 2 o'clock in Chicago? <laughs> Hey. So what's next? Um, you chose your car kit. Yes. The Peugeot. Yeah, the P Peugeot. Pug. Okay. <clears throat> mm -hmm. So while I'm waiting for that, I've got two more on the bench. And I've got I've got the Merc as my one I'm going to have a crack at. Yeah, I decided to play silly, silly buggers with a BMW M5. Yeah. Um, hang on, guys. I'll be back in a sec. Yeah. Somebody said that it'd annoy the Prius if I turned an M5 into a pro street car. You doing? Uh, James, James has seen my tower. <laughs> you know that big tower I got, James? Yeah. I just used my knee to. That was that big. <laughs> <sighs> just so don't break stuff. But it weighs so, thirty kilos, <laughs> and it's solid metal, and it doesn't give. Who yeah. Knew? That's what Pink said. Oh, here's Pete. I was watching him on this oh, this afternoon, and um, I like his new mic with all the intercut changing colours. That's pretty cool. It's very flash. Oh. And I couldn't work out what his instructions he was holding up was. Do you know what they were, Paul? Uh, was it for the grant? I like don't know what he was holding up, but... Oh, I think he's the lead, uh, the lead tank he's doing. Yeah, M. Lee. Okay, yeah, go. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I, Very cool. But, of course, I did the Australian one. Yeah. As you do. Yeah. So this is... This is the car kit I'm going to do. Right, Supra. Ooh, Supra. Yeah. Oh. And, and what, did, what did you decide on build? VC corner. Yeah, VC. Oh, yeah, above you, under up, up to your right hand corner. Yep. And then some some smart guy um, uh, has a particular orange color. For the Supra, although slightly different, the Fast and Furious Supra Orange Pearl. Yeah, he's got the same. Yep. Same. And I'll tell you what, thing. that's what the colour looks like when it's sprayed out. No, no way. I've, I've got to try spraying my paints. <laughs> you alright, mate? Yeah. How, how's, how's the young man's foot? Uh, better. Um, it was only a very 
slight fracture in his toe. No brain damage? No, no brain damage. Oh. Um, Takes after his mother then. Yeah, that's right. So he, he had a week off any training. Um, and then he went back to training uh, Wednesday and then also did a two-hour clinic on Thursday, then an hour and a half training when uh, Thursday night. Um, back at the gym as well. So he's back into it. And then also the other day just rode 40 kilometres around town on his bike. So... Uh -huh. So, yeah, and can't miss him because his bike's, like, bright green. So the neighbours know who it is. Dad, did you know if we have any white vinegar? I remember when I did something silly like that once. Um, well, yeah, yeah, the moral of the story is don't jump off jetties and you won't break your foot. No, you know, I'm talking me? about riding long distances. Oh. I, I rode from Ballina to Lismore, which is 30 k's one direction. Hung out with my mate for a couple of hours and then turned around and rode home on a BMX. Yeah. Like to see you do that now. <laughs> <laughs> I remember those days. Used to get on the bike, go for a ride. Slug gun yeah. strapped between the, the frame so you could go target shooting. Yeah, but target. remember, you had to have the playing card and the peg, mate. That was. Oh, yeah. You're going to yeah. get the red up. Uh, yeah, so this days, you could ride to Bankstown Square, ride around on a Sunday, ride around the car park and not get run over because the yeah. shops were shut. Yeah, and, and people weren't... going to kidnap you. Yeah, they weren't trying yeah. to run you over either. Yeah. yeah. Bloody I mean, you, right things. you could go oh. to car parks. You could go to all that sort of crap. You could do that on the weekend. Yeah, I, I, my I, remember I, used car to, I used to go hunting pigeons in the middle of town with an air rifle. <laughs> yeah, nobody better than I. Nope. No. Even the local well, sergeant. Especially if you got them right between them. Pigeon stew for dinner, young Wilesy. It's like, yes, Arge. All right, be safe. See ya. I always remember what my dad told me about him and his brother one day. They had an eye given. Only trouble is they both had 22, so they started taking pot shots at each other. <laughs> <laughs> All yeah. part of growing up in the bush. Yep. Yeah, that's it. That's right. Um, yep. Uh. I still don't blame my cousin for hitting me in the leg with an axe. I still remember out a place called Timor, just um, north of Scone, just before Murrundi. And um, I was out, out the back with... Um, I had a slug gun at my, mate, my best mate's growing up place and his younger brother, Whip, was out there and we had this ice cream container set up in the back fence. Now, this slug gun must have been 200 years old. Like, you could look at it and go off. Well, I'm not sure. <laughs> that's, that's this kind of hair trigger. Anyway, Whip was being a bit of a shit, and I was, you know, we're only 14 or whatever, and I said, don't stop moving, I'll shoot you, and the thing went off and got him right in the shoulder. <laughs> anyway, so he's off around the house. We're out in the bush, like bush, bush. Um, and so I'm up after him. Then my mate Chili's after me. We we're trying to like get out of whip. And then Mrs. Chilcott, she's after all of us. Anyway, so we get inside. Whip gets sat down. I cop a smack in the head from Mrs. Chilcott. Big Chill Dog gets a whack in the head from her as well. Because he was supposed to let me know that gun's got a hair trigger on it. And um, I got it for shooting, pointing a gun at somebody. Anyway, so Mr. Chilcott, all what, five foot one of him comes in. 
and uh, says, pours a shot of scotch and says to Whip, here, what Whip's only about, I'll have it. Drink this. this is He's going, right. No, I don't want it, Dad. I don't want it. He's... So he says, fine. Bang, he knocks it back, gets needle nose pliers and just pours a bit of scotch on there and just goes straight into the shoulder. Like you can see, the slug was about oh, two centimetres in, two and a half. He just put that needle nose straight in, ripped it out. He said, there's that problem solved. You've got a hole. <laughs> Yep. Pain yeah. goes away, wounds heal, some chicks dig scars. That's oh, yeah. it. He's still got it to this day, Whip, so that's pretty cool. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, that's it. Painting is done. What are you painting? Well, I've done uh, over the last couple of days. I've finished all the cam, cam work yep. on this. Uh, today I got the spinner done and the tail band, and now I'm just gonna let it cure off a bit and start on the decals. Nice. Right. That'll be fun. And then, it's, then the fun bit starts weathering. <laughs> or it could be factory straight from the factory. Come on now. Well, no, no. Yeah. Well, um. Because like one. one of the uh, you know, red, red when are you going to build yours, mate? When am I going to find time? That is this tank. I fuck you in it. Hang on. Oh shit! It's just Pete, Pete didn't glue the barrel in. <laughs> it's funny because. Nobody, no, I mean, the only person that's seen me having to move around a whole it is James. And you know, what I do, it's just, um, well, Pete did finish his, he did. I did send him an email too to join, but it's up to him. Um, he's probably, he's probably on the pool, he yeah. probably is somewhere. It'd be good if he is, he just pops in there, he is laying back. Look at his feet again, yeah. Oh, and that's what the Aslave looks like, Jason. Right, I might thanks for sharing. <laughs> yeah, thanks for sharing, mate. Uh, Did you finish the sub? Yeah, the sub did get finished, remember? That's the other as life. Oh, yeah, very good. Yeah. And Bill, did you... Oh, shit, there goes the challenger. If you want to do a good tank scheme, Bilge, have a go at the Berlin Brigade. Brigade. Oh, yeah. Um, actually, I reckon a challenging one would be the um, oh, World War, one of the World War II Panther schemes. It's just like um, mottled, mottled colours all over the place. Look, that one. No, no, it's like oh, it's it's hard to explain. You'd have to see it, but it's just it's like they've it's like where they've just thrown bits of paint everywhere because it was done yeah, in the field like before the they took it out. Going, going, yeah. squirt, 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 and right, then change. Out of that. Let's get another color. Yep. That is so that that, that hurts heap. So I get the. I think I've got some left, and there's none. Yeah. Yeah, so uh, mate, one mate's having a good afternoon. Yeah. He's got some family function on, so. Oh yeah. Yeah, I'll tell you what. Isn't he? He's he's like you, you guys. He just his level of modelling's up there. Just. I will be up there with you. Oh mate. You sell yourself so freaking short. Mm. <clears throat> did, oh, did I mention I, the parameter? I, I reckon I'm, I'm uh, even par with buffer. I, I yeah. live by the three foot rule. Yeah, you see from three foot. Looks great. Yeah. 
Did they don't mention the Parramatta one last night. No, but it's only once. And did you? Did I mention <laughs> that I had to? I, I couldn't do my pool try celebrations and victory dance because my darling three-month-old granddaughter was home. Well, you know you could have ta taught her the moves so she could join you when she's older. Um, that's uh, unfortunately, father's a Bronco supporter, and where did you go wrong? I I, I didn't get a chance. Yeah, so. Well, with my kids, I've got one out of one out of two. One's a Parramatta supporter, one's a South Sydney supporter. So, fifty-fifty, I'm okay. Yeah. Um. Although not 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 at the moment, <laughs> not if you're going on. No. If they're when dead, they show up, they'll be fine. Yeah, yeah, um, Next Essendon's year. the best team to follow. No, nah, but I was stoked how the boys turned up. And I mean, you think who we're missing in our injuries to get to knock off a team that's only lost once this year so far? Yeah. I was quite happy. Mm -hmm. But looking at this, Merck, you know, it's typical to me, really. It's just everything neat and tidy in a day. All right, just put the glue in the box, the paint, and just give it a shake. <laughs> Yes, I was ready to give up on Edward on aircraft after that Spitfire. Uh, Just couldn't get into it. You couldn't? No, I've got eight or nine Spitfires in here and I couldn't get into one more. I wish I could really take this into the neighbour's house. He was a Spitfire nut. Worse than you, Jason. No. He's uh, built every, every mark of Spitfire. Well, I'm glad he's built them. And... Well, he passed on now, but he built every mark. Oh, uh, he, oh, he, even did, he even did K504, 5054. Okay, yeah. Wow. It's a, it's a vacuum yeah. form kit. Yeah. And well, how did he get out of that? I don't know. He's in the IPM. IPM oh. That's at the Classic Modelling Club. Yeah. And um, well, you, it was also a watchmaker, so you can imagine what the attention to detail was like. I mean, absolutely. Yeah, yes. This is a very simple kit. No, that's the way to me, I make it look. Yeah. Very simple build by the look of it. By the look of it. By the look of it. Yeah, remember those words. Okay. All right. <coughs> BMW Chevy Spitfire out of the way. Uh, yes, I'm still waiting on those motors to come from um, Melbourne via China. <laughs> Apparently, you can get different schemes for that kit too, Jason. What, the uh, Merv? Yeah. Yeah, oh, there's oranges and there's Actually, yeah, quite it. a few. Look at this one. Let's come on. I'm doing J. I let me see where I am with my um now it's twenty fourth of May they're gonna be here. Okay. It's been uplifted from the United Arab Emirates. Who did you order it through? eBay. Oh, Christ, you should have gone through Amazon. So. 
I mean, the they 21st had your... of, 21st of March to the 5th of April and our 14th, it's got dispatches now received it. Yeah, the instructions are the same, Jason. They are too, mate. Must be a Tamiya thing. Yeah. Yeah. Very simple. What you call me? Yeah. I'm um, got. Where is this other bugger I want to do? Ah, oh, is that This is the one I tried for the 24-hour build. Or the 48-hour build. No, yeah, 24-hour build. I bought another one because the other one just... Yeah, was not, not impressed with it at all. And I'd like to spend a lot of time on that and modify it with lights and stuff, so... Yeah. I'm, I'm sorry, I've gone really off electronics after seeing Seamus's build of the helicopter I've done. <laughs> he, he, he certainly knows how to put you in your place, doesn't he? Yeah. yeah. You, just, you, you just like... Uh, this is the who, helicopter I did for Sue's build. Who was that you said, did the electronics? Seamus BM, oh, CB BMW. Yeah. Is he so on he's YouTube? Doing one... yes, oh, yeah, he he's is. on YouTube, man. Hang on. He, he's doing one of these. Hang on. The only thing it doesn't <coughs> do... Oh, no, the rotors do spin, don't they? Oh, yeah, both of them. Yeah, that's right. He's got the rotors working and everything. So I did this yeah. one for the second one on Sue's build. Nice. Because the sycamore took, didn't take long enough. <laughs> I can see it there every every time he does a, a vehicle. I say, when are you going to make the wipers work? What's his? S E A M. Yep. Or S E A B M W. C B M W. Yeah. He is the master of electronics. The only thing I could pick him up on is when he showed the rotors working on Sue's stream is how come he didn't make them fold? Is that S-E-A? <laughs> so Sierra, Echo, Alpha, Bravo, Mike, Whiskey. Yep. On YouTube? Yes. No space? Hang on. Where is he? 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 Somebody find him for me. Come on, see me. Where are you? Oh, Wombat's live. Yeah. Where is Seamus? G'day, Hibbo. Right oh, he knows it. Sierra, 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 Echo, Alpha, Mike. Yankee, bravo. Oh, Gotta spell slowly. Sierra, Echo, Alpha, Mike. Yankee, bravo, yeah. Mike, whiskey. <clears throat> yeah, where was I? Yeah. I'm already subscribed. Okay, all right. <laughs> I, I like his um his uh checkpoint he done with all the trucks and the figures. Oh, that was amazing. And oh, and not only that, but the the oh. the dozer. It's actually got a sound card in it. Yes, uh, Seamus is ridiculous. He is a master at what he does. There's a um. An Aussie guy that I saw your you follow Bilge, Aussie Trekkie. Yeah. So he um he had a bit of a down a week the other, a few weeks ago. He wasn't doing too well, but he seems to have picked up a bit. Um, yeah. But yeah, 
all into his Star Trek stuff and trucks as well, I think it was, wasn't it? Yeah. Um, I actually, when I first come across him, he was, uh, there was an old movie called Jewel. Oh, it's a great movie. Yeah. Well, he scratch built the truck out of that with the trailer and everything. Hey, I'm in the truck. And we all know that Star Wars is the best, but anyway. Oh, well, I'll go get the Millennium Falcon then. Well, that's better then. That, that'll make me feel good about living. <coughs> hey, TV, how are you, mate? This, uh, All right. A pair of TIE know. fighters. Oh, very good. Very good. That's that, they're a bit smaller than a Millennium, but anyway. Okay. They've only got two inches of dust on them. Okay, T15. Space speeder. Cool. T3. MPC snow speeder. Oh, okay. That would have gone together like just immaculately out of the box. Yeah, and Luke Skywalker looked like nothing. Look, nothing like Luke Skywalker, even with the helmet on. That one. Well, I'm guessing Hibbo loves um, Star Trek because he doesn't <laughs> like Star Wars. Right. Okay. Okay. How much photo are you trying to get out of them? How much you got left on that, mate? Oh. <clears throat> Uh, it's, there's probably half left on there. Don't put the rudder pedal straps in. Oh, they're shit. You can't okay. see them. I um, I tried. It didn't work, so they came off. <clears throat> Don't make the mistake okay. I made with the HKB17. What happened? I put the full Edward interior in it. Oh, so and you couldn't see it? No. Nah. No. Nah. But I did put brass barrels on it because I stepped all the pla stepped all the plastic ones off. I tell you what I'm chasing, I'm I've been over and over like when I get time, is those micro very like micro micro video cameras that you can put like a little L C D outside. And with your interior lighting and those cameras, you'll be able to see your interior. You've got too much money to spend, Jason. <laughs> no. I just, I think you go to all that effort. I know it's there. Yeah, I mean, I know it's there too, but yeah, yeah somebody, oh, I thought, have a look, oh, where's the detail? Like, you know, well. And all the that, extra, um, you, yeah. you're right, mate? All the extra. All the extra ammunition crates fit in the back of a 148 American truck. Well, on the length, I especially that 132. Um, I'd like to be able to have that to show all that. Get the crew for it. The, what you, still, you want to be able to see them, and you want. People to be able to no, see them in the detail. The crew, the crew isn't in, but they're walking to the aircraft. Yeah. And if it's done properly, there should be at least two of them piddling on the back wheel. Right. Eh? Who's that three? Can you send me that email? Um, I'll see if I can find it. Okay. It's one thirty fifth scale, isn't it? Or one thirty two. One thirty two. And um, Pete's worried about. Uh, sorry, Hibbo is worried about um, Pete's uh, crotch. Um, so the love continues. Uh, this one's going to be yours. Oh. Uh, oh, yeah, very good. Who's that through? Um. That's on Evil Bay, I think. $138. Wow. Okay. But the kit's worth $1,200. What's wrong? I know. I've got two of them. <laughs> it's 
Still one by the crew. No, one's got to go down south, so. Yeah. Um. <laughs> yeah. Cool. Oh, Himbo's in fine form. Oh, he's. Oh, he's, he's, he's. I don't know if he's been having his afternoon drinks. He's. Whatever he's doing, but he's. He's on the mark, so that's all good. Make it up for lost time. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. But I hope he's doing well out there because he earned the shit out of that job. Yeah, yeah like he really... Um... How did all the bushfires and stuff go, uh, Hibbo? Did any of that affect you, either at work or at home? Well, he did share a photo of himself in the uniform. His yeah, police he uniform. He was young back then. Had hair. Oh, shit, I shouldn't say well, that. Yeah, well, well, well. Well, I've got none. Well, you do have some. Yeah, it's, it's sort of receding. Two kids and eight hey. grandchildren will do that. Uh, mate, look, 11. Look, full head. What yeah, are you going on about? You must have... You're lucky. <laughs> ah, it's all good. Um, I think it's the kids that give you make you lose your hair. Jeez. So what have we got planned for this week, guys? I might start a fire engine. Okay. Wouldn't be well, a, a Rebel one, would it? Yeah, I did make Pete buy one. <laughs> so I suppose I better build it. As long as it goes better to get together better than that bloody bus. And uh, what's your handicap now, Hibo? By the look of it? Golf. Yeah. Have you... Are you up eight yet? Seven, five. Use the right computer, Paul. Good idea, mate. I've got one the laptop running for the, the chat and the desktop running for the stream. James. It's confusing. If I was gone, there's no, there was no issues for buyers with him, so. Oh, let's Should right, try man. harder. He obviously didn't use an office color. Two, out. There you go, good. Yeah, I've yeah. seen the way you build, build you are. What? You just said you were good. I said I've seen the way you build. You are. And I was going to show you number forty-four. Ah, oh, very good. Get him! Ah, oh, that that <laughs> that is brilliant. Thirty foot ending up within two foot. Yep. Yeah. Here. But hey, I, I um came second the other week, so I was happy. So good stuff. Yeah, that was. Actually, I'll I'll up, I'll up your little badge you've got there. I'll, I'll yeah. see that, and I'll raise you this one. Oh, nice! Very nice. That was sent to me as a, an appreciation for always just being a good person and, you know, uh, acknowledging their work and all that stuff and just being supportive and, yeah. That's good. Have you got all the trees trimmed? <clears throat> Boy, don't you yeah. tell us here, man. 
And unless you know where to look, you wouldn't know that I've trimmed the lone, lone pine at our memorial, which is what I was hoping for. Yeah, we're a bit worried about that during the week. <laughs> yeah, well, I actually had, there was quite a few people that knew what it was and they were stopping and asking lots of questions. And I just told them straight and they're like, oh, oh, okay, no worries. Let you get back to work. And it's like, thank you. I'd like to get out of here. So it should be good. And it actually, um, I was requested to do it, not by council, but actually um, someone that I know that's in the uh, local 41st Battalion. Okay. Well, that's good. Uh, yeah. And by the way, I, I forgot to mention, it'll be going, once I've put it up on the website, Moss, and you know this probably already, Paul, but... Um, yes, 46 and days and counting. Yep, he is the um, official distributor now for um, Outlaw. Awesome. Very good. What was 46 days and counting, Paul? Uh, I went on his website. Yep. And, he, and he's got a countdown till they arrive. Oh, okay. Until, I he's, know. until he's taking orders. Now, yeah. Outlaw.com or UK yeah, or something. Yeah, okay, UK and Outlaw.com or... or Oh, I've got his email with that, so he's just <coughs> on this side of the shipping and that, and I've got numbers. He's, so what we were because talking about you, before, I've got all those um, colours. Yeah, when you mentioned it this it. afternoon, I went and had a look. What's that? When you mentioned it this afternoon, I went and had a look. Oh, he's got those ones. Yeah, 46 days and counting. Okay. Um, is the website up officially, is it? Um, just a sec. Well, I can have a look, I suppose, too. Nice comment there, Hibbo. I'm sure she appreciates it, she appreciates it as well. Um, mate, in reflection on that comment, there's not once I've got managed to come for so. Uh, Oh, uh, yep, there it is. Um, yeah, he's... Yeah, 45 days, the website's going to be up and running well, and... I think he might be running out of paint, so. You reckon? Yeah. Why is that? Well, he's he's keen to get it. Oh, mate, he's got a few. He's got a fair bit there, not much, but I think because. <laughs> he only won the entire range. Hey. He only won the entire range. Oh, no, mate, no, he's. He bought no, it all. Yeah. For his own you personal use. Like, no. Because I, I spoke to him about a, a Zoom or a WhatsApp. I said, oh, yeah, you've got that. He said, what? Nobody gets that. Pity <laughs> with the ads, lab and the tanks. <laughs> and the... Um, Hang on, I'm just here. Just here. And the Lancaster. And, 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 and I'll get some sleep, yeah. Oh, very good. Yeah, you've seen hey, those. Just cheering here, Bo, up. Yeah. Why not throw in the tank as well? Oh, okay. How's your building going, here, Bo, or are you off, off the uh, plastic for the moment?
Yeah, nice looking tank, that. Yeah, pity the grew the gun in. Yeah, you're right. Yeah, I'll fix that later. He's not doing any. No. Nah. No. What Paul wins. Thanks. Oh, Paul. I know, mate. Why have you got to move? I thought you had that place secured. That sucks. Was that even six months, Hibbo? One other thing to say in Brock, we trust. Yep. It was 12 months already. Far out. Right? Bloody con's gone far. Oh, Dumsy. Hey, Everything done. Up 12, up 110. Whoa. Jesus, <laughs> Jesus Louises, 110 a week. Brag that for a joke. Hey, I'll see if this uh, Ed from is good good for a um, jump on the live stream from Arizona. Oh, so many fucking places in there. Well, you will go well bored. Yeah. And for the old farts on the stream. Yeah. Oh, very good. How many bedroom have I for 600? Ocean views, but you've already got there when you're at work. Living cost of you, Scottish. Thank you. Chunksy, good grief. We're getting it. Um, I've got no idea on the likes. I'm leaving that in your. Um, <laughs> You and uh, James or Paul, I've got no idea on that, so I'll just leave oh. that. Don, we are good, so mate. Far. We are good. Five likes, eight watching. Five likes, and we've got eight, 18 watching now, mate. Refresh again. 17, 16. I don't know. I might be on the wrong channel. All right. Yeah, well. There's, there was nobody on the Aussie model as well. That's Aussie scale modeler. That's why I slipped over to here. Yeah. 14. He's back in the desert on a horse with no name. Yeah, Dom's on Aussie modelers. And Southwest is there. Thanks, Richard. And Bill, we'll you're still waiting for the email. Hey? Eh? <laughs> yeah, not worried. As I said, not worried about the like, well, the actual monetization or anything like that. Um, I know Wombat um, offered to chip in for this stream out platform, which was nice of him. I've got to send him a bill, so... No, I don't want to do a smart scam now. <laughs> they always they always send that to you when you're actually doing oh, something. Bloody Nortons. If they're not trying to upsell me on something, they're trying to get me to do something I don't want to do. It's like being married. I don't know. It's been a, been a while. <laughs> I don't have that problem anymore. I haven't had that problem since 
So the son's 30 now. Daughter was five. She's. I haven't had right. that problem. Wait, someone. There's an echo. Why is oh, that sound? And, and we got yeah. we got double we got double thumbs up there from Chunk. So you know, that's pretty cool. And the thumb up, thumbs up, King Richard up. Thomas is keeping an eye on it. Here you go, Richard. Dominic wanted to say hello. Oh. So my daughter bad. daughter bought a German Shepherd Bilge. Yeah, Does he eat much? She's the no biggest shits everywhere, apparently. Aren't you? Hey? Eh? I don't have any. Oh, down. No, down. Down. Thank you. Uh, endless lucky fur. Oh, well. Summer coat's going. Winter coat's, coat's coming. Yeah, I'm just glad she's not a long head. <laughs> oh, thanks, Richard. Excellent, mate. Much appreciated, mate. Um, I've got. I'm seeing twenty here now. Like it says twenty, so I don't know what's going on. Nineteen, twenty. I don't know how it all works, but hey. Well, GB Models wants to know how the Lancaster bomber's going, Jason. Um, as I was just sharing, with everybody. I'm waiting, and it was supposed to be a surprise, and everything, but I've got these little electric motors. So um, they did say, and I'll go back to eBay again. Well, that'll keep the dust off it. Oh, no, it's, it's, it's looked after. I'll go to, go to my thing here, my eBay purchase history. I know B and A have been trying to sell me the HK one forty eight dam busters link. Yeah, so I ordered this on the twentieth of March, and they said it was going to be April. Um, sorry, at the start of April. Now it's going twenty fourth of May. So they're the four oh eight size models. Hey Jeff. Um. And yeah, so I've got quite a few of them, and um, yeah, so one is for the Spitfire, and um, four are uh, for the 172 link. Hey, hello in the Shetland Islands. Um, Shetland Islands, Jesus. I wonder if they got Shetland ponies. I wonder if well, hopefully ponies. that's where they came from. Yeah, I'm thinking oh. Shetland Islands, Shetland. But they must be good swimmers if it's on an island. <coughs> so, yeah, um, yes. GB, that's what's happening with those, mate. Um, we really like can't it. make any more progress because the wiring and everything's <laughs> got to go in and I've got to make sure it will work fine. Um Kitchen table modeler. I am going to go right now and just check if I've subscribed to you, mate. And, you know, if you go do a Google search, it doesn't work because <laughs> you got to do that on eBay. Uh, not eBay, YouTube. What's that, darling? Oh, am I with it? Yeah. I've been, yeah, Hippo's been on, so... Yeah, he hasn't actually been on, but um, I bet it. Yep, there he is. Subscribe. Done. KB. And GB model. I wonder if I've subscribed. I better get notifications all from Kitchen Tales. Um, and who else do I want there on GB model? Uh, let's see if we got him there. Oh, Christ, what a horrible sight. GB. Let's go with a bigger B. Well, dog's got to go walk his dog. GB, what's your... Um... 
is that your actual YouTube GB models? Hang on, Bilge. He's back here. Press the wrong button like a smart. We'll see you back in 15, Dom. Yeah, Richard, GB, there we go. Is that no? Is that really Richard? GB. Apparently, apparently, Richard's ordered a DDA Monaro. Yeah, I hear. GB, is that you with your shirt off? Five, five, six, nine. Very nice, Paul. Very nice. That's a DDA kit, Richard. No glue needed. They just screw together. Let's have a look. Okay, no. let's go, Sir Richard Thomas. Scale model world. I am subscribed to you, Sir Richard. Very good. GB models. And you have now another subscriber, mate. Notifications are all. I like the ability to be able to put shit on everybody when I like. Cool. <laughs> now, mate, so there you go. Um, I don't know if anybody hasn't subscribed, but he's got 389 subscribers now. As G so we let's get over to his channel and click on him if you haven't. Um, <clears throat> yeah, very good. Let's just see. Let's have a bit of a peek. Was that an MG I see? Very cool. Jack Villeneuve's Ferrari or Jill. Oh, it's even got the mini chance on the Goldwing. Is there any plastic here, JB? What a collection, mate. Wow, that is very impressive, mate. If you got you guys should actually go and have a look at his channel. I mean, there's a lot of die casts there. But what a collection I, I did. Yeah, I did I'm already so Oh, he's even got a Herbie. Ah. Oh, and the original Batman, very cool. Done. And we all got a supply to... Um, hey, mate, how are you? Good to see you. Um, yeah, well, that is just bloody awesome. Prize critters. Yeah, now, he, he's a local bloke. He deals in creepy, crawly, slithering things. Ooh. He, 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 and lizards and everything and... Oh, don't don't show ice cream. Yeah, yeah. Sure. <laughs> she, might, she might burn another Lancaster. Yeah. yeah, he's he's got some skills with that. So, um, I think he he, he breeds everything like children. <sighs> So he's got a, he's got a few of them. He's got snakes. He's got lizards. Oh, I'm not right sure on the spiders. 
uh, but yeah, he's very competent, and I think he's registered as an identifier of snakes in this country. So my wife's good at, you know, Mrs. Outlaw is very good at identifying snake. Look, there's a snake. Job done. <laughs> Kill it. <laughs> Last time I saw a snake, I was using the whipper snipper. <laughs> I um I actually I was in the back back machinery shed yesterday and I found I found the skin and once I straightened it out it was just shy of eight foot long. Okay. Well that explains why the chickens are my gone. baby my baby carpet snake's still around. Yeah. So just as an those prize, so Bill Bilge is very competent around snakes as well. Um, very good. He, he's a animal lover as well, or a reptile lover as well. I just got a healthy respect for him. Yeah, well, Mrs. Outlaw's got the same. I don't know if it's healthy for the reptiles, but. Yeah, my grandfather had the same respect for snakes. Right. I told you boys a story when I was in Bunnings one day. I'm, I'm just getting some stuff a few years back now. All of a sudden get this phone call and the phone's going crazy. Come home now, there's a snake in the house. There's a snake in the house. And I'm thinking, snake, you know. They, and... They're, they're all on the kitchen table, like a snake ain't going. If it wants to go up, it'll get up. And I go in there, and there's three women on the kitchen table, and the noise was there. Um, where I'm going? Well, where, where is this thing? And it was about that big. So literally, I'm not hurting my arm. Oh. Maybe that big, but it was a baby brown. Oh, okay. And he was very animated, so to speak. And shovel time. He did, he did need to uh, leave the planet. Um, yeah, so he, no, I, he went, I got no qualms about knocking browns on the head. Yeah, so, what do you reckon, Fry, mate? Are the are browns. Worth knocking off if you're, uh, what did you just sit and wait until they bite you? <laughs> well, I've got little ones around here, so when it yeah. comes to bring ones, nope, not messing around with them. Build a shovel. Yeah, so that's the, um, and unfortunately, because because we don't have black snakes here, we got browns, and that's really frustrating. Well, there we go. From a professional, like certified human being, well, if in doubt, take it out. Oh, I moved. We moved it to heaven. <laughs> it went to snake heaven. Yeah, and uh, I mean. No, I know when it comes to snakes, I wouldn't have your knowledge. Or I've got some, but I do know that um, baby browns are more lethal if they can get their fangs in here than mummy and daddy. So, yep, because their venom is a lot more toxic. Yeah. Um, what would be the best one thirty-five? What s? What's SCI. Does it say SCI? SCL. Let's have a peek. What's that? Uh... Anybody? Anybody? What? What? GB. Hey, guys, what would be the S135 SCL? One thirty-fifth SCL. 
One thirty fifth scale, what? One thirty fifth scale. Yeah. So you're looking at military there, mainly. Well, at least armor. Yeah, some sort of armor. Yeah. Um, Anybody? Anybody? Well, it depends, oh. Price. Mm. I believe um, <coughs> Liam makes a good tank. I'll be back in a moment. Well, ap apparently the um, the 88 millimeter from Dustwork is a real pain in the rectum. Oh, that's coming from Nigel. <laughs> yes, yeah, that was... Um, I cracked it when he threw it. I thought that was hilarious. Well, he's actually he threw it. Yeah, he threw it. He actually just gone, it's pissing me off. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. One way to get views. Uh, I thought, oh, that's it. End of it. But no, nah, he obviously went and had a bit of time out and come back and got it. Has he finished the tank transfer uh, yet? Uh, he wants a length. I would. I don't know. If there's one thirty fifth. I know there's one thirty second. Yeah, you've got two. Yeah. I haven't seen a one thirty fifth length. Have you? Anybody else? I've never seen a one thirty five length. I've never. Never seen one thirty fifth, but one thirty two. I. I don't think there is. I think there's I border think, and HK um, that do the 132s. Um, I'll just do a Google on. I'm not a hundred percent sure, but I think. What was the, the messy shit that uh, Nigel built? Was that 135th? 135th. 135th border, I think. Yeah. No, he's he, the one. Actually, Border does do it. Yeah. No, they don't. No, it's no, 132 because I've got two of them. And he did the okay. HK. Um, Cause I, I think somebody... Yeah, I'm going back a long bloody way, though. That's the problem. Because I remember once somebody saying, oh, that will go nice next to my 135th truck or whatever it is or something like that. I, I thought it was Nigel, but I could be wrong. No, it, um, I would be going... Personally, for detail, GB, I've got the two. I've got two of those one thirty twos. Um, I know in the UK you can get the Dam Buster. Um, That's just been advertised at B and A. Yeah. Um, we were told. I was told when I was talking to Hobbies Australia they weren't getting them in. Um, B and A have the one forty eight. Yeah. They're not getting the 132. Um, if you want a large one and you've been building for a while, and only if you've been building for a while, I would get the border. Even then, in saying that, if you go to the HK, you are looking at reasonable skills to build that. Um, I don't know about that. I did. Mate, you've got more than reasonable skills, so... You, you need You're experience to build it. Some sort of modelling history and builds behind you to build it. Yeah, so depending on your skill levels, mate, um, or if you're not in a rush to build it and you're very patient, definitely go, yeah, that's beautiful, mate. There you go, GB. And you don't even have to glue the wings on. Yeah, that's the HK. Yep. Yeah, so. Same with their B17. Yeah. But I would recommend getting the Master Barrels guns for it. Yeah. Very nice, mate. Why isn't that suspended on the ceiling? But anyway. Because it's got a shelf. Okay. Very cool. With all, with all the other British aircraft. I personally, if you had the time and patience 
and skills to rectify certain things on the border. The detail, the detail is much better than HK. And if you want real, real good um, tips and tricks, especially with like the border lengths, watch Nigel. Nigel. If you would like to add to your vocabulary, watch Nigel. Watch Nigel. <laughs> if you're trying to get hair um, on your head, don't watch Nigel. Yeah, and he does drive a Mustang, but we won't let, we won't bring that into it. Well, I've, I mean, it's a Ford, so how often do you actually get to drive it? True. I mean, <laughs> tow truck rentals must cost heaps, but anyway. Never tell him in a live stream what you know where a Mustang looks good. Oh, oh yeah, I'm up in for a mate okay. now, <laughs> In the mirror of an SS. Yeah. <laughs> In the rear he video. did. Yes, he didn't like that, but it was fun. <laughs> hey, Bryce, um, haven't you got a kit? Or what are you? What are you missing, mate? Give me. I think you've got my number, mate. Give me a bell. I might be able to help you out. I've been known to do that. Who are you talking to? Heart bigger than father. Try it. Um. What am I looking for here besides? Oh. And it's the last night of the Masters, so. Yeah. Okay. I didn't qualify for him this year. Right. Mm. Oh. I want. Where is my? No worries, mate. I will answer that message. Um. So we're missing Bilge, we're missing James. Our Bilge is back. No, I was looking for my um, water dish for my decal. Okay. Well, decals, depending on where you are in the in the universe. Did I mention again the Parramatta one? I just. Oh, well, it's only twice. Well, they won. It was great. It was a beautiful moment. Keep telling you, Essendon's the only real football team. That's not a sport. Go play hiding yourself. Oh, please. Kick it to me. Kick it to me. Yeah. Kick you somewhere in a minute. <laughs> Good luck, big fella. Get below decks where you belong. Way below decks. Just because you like playing with long phallic things. Hey, mate, nothing wrong with fish. Nothing wrong with fish. Yeah, set of headphones and a big tube with a big fish. So, what's your plans for the week, young Paul? Well, I just keep doing the same thing I've been doing. Okay, the excitement builds. Yeah, not a lot. And, and what, what decals are you sending me, by the way? The tribute decals for seniors build. Oh, right. Thank you, mate. Uh, you're getting a set too, Bilge. Oh, okay. Yeah, I ordered Thank 10. You, and what about you, young James? What's yours, mate? <coughs> For the weekend. The week. um, I need to angle grind the kid's old swing set down so I can take it to uh, that and some other 
steal stuff, take it to the metal recycling, and probably get, you know, Shot five dollars. And, and, um, and then uh, appointment Tuesday. Uh, that's kind of it at the moment. Okay. And not that exciting, but more stuff will pop up as the week comes on. So, what engine bay were you just showing there, Bilge? Oh, that's the um. I shot I shot the colour in that today. Done the bonnet jam. Can we see it that. again? Close up. Very nice, mate. Uh, GB's Thanks. asking this probably. Yeah, very nice. Um, what do you guys think of the colour on the F35A? Uh, if anybody's yeah. done it, what colour? It is. <coughs> it doesn't have a colour. It's a pain in the art. That's what it is. Because currently nobody makes the color all the recommendations and everything is actually a mixture of two or three grays so this was my one i made a while ago i thought i made up enough paint i got to the point of uh, dealing with the canopy i had no more paint and so it just fit in my boneyard. What did you use, Paul? Uh, a grey. Yeah. <clears throat> and don't try to paint the ram tape anymore. Because the ram tape is now the same colour as the aircraft. Yep. Yep. And don't leave the aircraft out in the rain because the they coating on the sky. The skin falls apart. What are you? What has it got on the cut? Um, nah, let me go back here. Oh, yes. oh. Be back. I'm trying to build. Oh. Trying to order dinner. Okay. Um. So, I bought this kit for my son. And. What? Don't you like him? <laughs> he wanted it for his birthday. Okay. So, on the back, they say uh, Humbrol 164. And when you Google. Humbrol 164, it comes up as, whoops, wrong button, James, uh, dark sea grey, which is not correct. No, uh -huh. it is a camouflage grey with a metallic in it. And then that is... All right, so it's FS36170 is its official number, and it's got um, a metallic... Metallic almost, yeah. Um, I can make that. I can make that. You'd do well out of it, Jason, because if uh, you become the only paint manufacturer that actually manufactures that colour, because it's the only colour the F-35s are, um, some of the American ones do have some colourful tails for the CAG aircraft, but... Oh, yeah, but your you fuse large and everything else, your you large services. Yeah, that is the only colour. Um, the, uh, the tint on the canopy um, is like a mixture of clear yellow and gold, and then yeah. there's lots of... I think I used uh, some of the light, long life floor polish um 
but you know the kids for the canopies are another one that is a hit and miss because you might do what someone says but it doesn't come out the color you want it no so i know i've got to make boyd red i've told that to go up nuts in the states so yeah and when i was at yours you do have the dark ghost gray yep but it's not on the website okay um so then also probably with the dark ghost gray the light ghost gray because yep. those are the two primary colors for uh 90 percent of the world's fam classic and super hornet colors oh, right. so anyone, that, anyone that flies that that right. thing, well you, you always know that i got when it comes to jets i couldn't care if they were burning flame <laughs> i know they're not, they're not a spitfire well, they don't exist. Yep. Yep. But gentlemen, that's it. Six thirty-six, and I'm gonna have to bail. Yeah, mate. Um, I can leave you guys to it. If you want to keep going, people have got places to be and models to build. Yeah. yeah dinner to eat, and then right out. And next food. week, guys, for those overseas, um, we will be doing it. At 11 a.m., okay? All being well. I'm putting that in my calendar. Oh, yeah. Yeah, uh, 11 a.m. Uh, be there, um, be square there, Paul. Um, yeah, I'll be there. I'll talk to Jim in the States and, um, yeah, we'll get him on. Um, yeah, did you did you see, like, not that... He's up over a hundred and something thousand. Um, on ah. extra dark, right? Um, yeah. Yeah, 109,000 views just on that. See you, JP. Right. Later, bud. And, yeah, I just can't wait because he's got a care package on its way. It's actually landed in my Emmy at 6 9 this morning. So, yeah, looking forward to seeing, yeah, that. Nice. But anyway, guys, love you, Zeeps. You take care, and um, we'll speak to you later in the week. See you, everybody. Later, all. It's all good. Thank you again. Catch you next Cheers. week, 11 a.m. Queensland time. New South Wales as well. Ah. Yeah, Australian <laughs> time. It's standard time now, Jason. Yeah, EST. Yep. See you, guys. Bye. Bye.